Hi guys and welcome to a, another Let's Play. So I made a character using the story mode so give me some restrictions of what I was doing. So that I hope it's romantic, mean and ambitious. I wanted to be a bit like a cold hearted bitch yet at the same time like she still wants to you know like meet someone. Um, so with her like everyday outfit I want her to wear quite like restricted like sort of harsh clothes, nothing that's like blowy and stuff that's what i want to sort of stay away with so we went for this top and skirt um i was trying to find some types of like ages and i couldn't find them then eventually did so i came back to the outfit um yeah so got into the formal wear wasn't a fan of all the accessories that we had so i got rid of all of those as i'm still new on the game i was really struggling to find how to get rid of the accessories but eventually I get there. Um, I also go back a few times because they need to like add makeup and stuff. Um, yeah I was just looking at some of the outfits that I've got that I haven't really had to look at so it's sort of the first time I'm seeing the items as well the outfits. Uh, so we went for this really nice fitted top those earrings really annoy me and they kept appearing all the time um yeah so she's wearing her heels and she's just like a sassy biatch for her fitness she's yeah she's just going to be showing up her fit and sex the mother because why would you not and then yeah i just what was i doing here I don't know. Oh, okay. So, yeah, we're on sleepwear. So, for sleepwear, I thought she should wear, like, a guy's top. Because I think it would show that, like, she used to be with someone. So, that's why she's hopeless romantic. Because, like, that's her, like, true love. But, like, he left her. Which is why she's a bit of, like, a bitch now. Um, you may also notice that she has, like, a scar above her eye. We don't know why she's got that, but I kind of thought it was a cool touch. Um, if any of you have watched like Orphan Black, I sort of wanted her to have the look of like Rachel. Well, she's like Rachel inspired basically. Um, yeah, and also it was like quite fun, like trying to work with like the makeup and like dark skin tone. I felt like I'd be a bit more creative than what I'm using. And then we get on to party wear. So for party wear, I thought. Um, after like looking at a few things that I didn't like, would go for something that was just like a little bit more like edgy. Uh, so you'll see that in a minute. I think it was the like leather jacket with like spikes in there. Um, as original, I was gonna go for that one, but then I realized that it was a bit too formal. Uh, did I go for a trouser or skirt in the end? I think I went for trousers, and it's the only outfit that we did. That's just very good. Uh, because obviously I'm not very good at doing all this annotations and stuff. And this is where I thought for a second I'd go for something like loose, and I was like, nope, she needs to be going for stuff that is like form fitting. And obviously we still have to have high heels, so every single outfit she is wearing high heels, whether it is sun, snow, she is up the beach, well not at the beach, I don't think she wears heels at the beach, but on every single thing she is wearing her heels, um, for her beach wear I was originally going to have it so it looks like she goes like this pamper thing, but then I thought you know what, she has a rocking body so i was like we are showing off that body and also i thought we'd go for some lighter colored stuff because usually for most of her outfits have been quite dark and then finally for the summer wear again all the accessories which I have to keep taking off i don't if any of you know of a way to get the accessories just gone instantly please let me know so what should we go for the summer this is the one i can't remember what we did yeah i think it was just like a nice another like quite fitted outfit um, and again with the heels and then for the winter wear I really love this coat but I wanted to go for the dark one but I was like if she's actually inside she'd be wearing what's underneath so we had to go for whatever was like black dress underneath so it was more like the coat didn't actually matter and again with the heels because like she is all about them heels um yeah, I think 
this is just another look. I just like changing her form. Also, you may have noticed her name. Um, that was my uh, boyfriend messing around and gave her that name originally. And then we eventually changed it. So her name isn't actually Shisha Fibed. Um, her name is actually, I think it's Anaya. Um, I can't remember the surname, but I know it's Anaya. Um, Anaya, I was just going through loads. Anaya Shroud. So yeah, um, see you guys next time. Uh, I will be putting her onto the gallery as well if you'd like her. Thanks, bye!